Hm? Come to gawk at the monster. The little girl is dead because of me. Believe me, it wasn't anything I ever intended to do. I just lost control. I tried to tell them, but none of them believe me. It's all on account of this blasted ring. This is the ring of Hersing. I was told it could let me control my transformations. Perhaps it used to, but I'll never know. Hersing didn't care for my taking it and threw a curse on it. I put it on, and the changes just came to me. I could never guess when. It would be at the worst times, like with the little girl. I don't suppose there's a point in keeping the secret if I'm going to die in here anyway. I'm sure you've heard of men who shift to beasts under the influence of the moons. I am one of them. A werewolf. It's my secret and my shame. That's why I wanted the ring. It was said to give men like me control. Now, I may look like a man, but I still feel the animal inside of me as strong as ever. I had just come into Falkreath. They needed some help work in the mill, and I thought that would be something safe, something I could do. When I saw the little girl, I was just... I could feel it coming on. I could taste her. I needed to hunt. But this pitiful, limited body wasn't meant for hunting. Slow, no claws. Weak, mashing teeth for shoeing cud. I held in my rage as long as I could, but it boiled inside of me. She looked so fragile, helpless prey, and then I... I feel terrible about what happened, about what I did. It would probably be best for everyone if I just went away. I've been looking for a way to appease Hersing. There is a certain beast in these lands, large, majestic. It's said that Hersing will commune with whoever slays it. I tracked it into these woods, but then I had my accident with the child. I want to beg his forgiveness, give him back the ring. But while I'm stuck in here, the beast wanders free. Oh my, you would do this for me? Here, take it. I, I don't want anything to do with this wretched thing anymore. Seek out the beast. He wanders these woods. Bring him down and... Well, the Lord of the Hunt should smile on you. I wish you luck. But you leave here while I still have my skin. Should our paths cross again, I will remember your kindness. Farewell. Imagine blowing up an entire town.
of the glorious stalker that your kind calls Hercene. Your fealty is precious to me. I will make good use of it. You bear my ring. The one who stole it has fled to what he thinks is his sanctuary. Just as a bear climbs a tree to escape the hunt, but only ends up trapping himself. Seek out this rogue shifter. Tear the skin from his body and make it an offering to me. Fly, my hunter. There are others who vie for my favor. A bit of competition. Don't dally while the prey flees. Admon called you, fellow hunter. The prey is strong, stronger than the hunters. But more will come. Bring him down for the glories of Lord Hirsin. <laughs> You... what? And I would deserve it, wouldn't I? I can't stop you if that's what you want to do. Hersing is too powerful. But if you spare me, I can be a powerful ally to you. And I would promise to never return to civilized life. I know now that I can't live among people. Thank the gods. Now let's deal with these other hunters. We hunt together.
Thank you for your help. I will make my home here away from anyone I might hurt. Well met again, Hunter. Not a failure, my servant. By bringing down my other hunters, you turn the chase inside out. And they were no base prey. You continue to amuse and impress. Go forth with my blessing.